is up everybody body 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 and welcome back to another marvel stab video 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 so today guys of course bring you all a brand new deck and this deck guys this is a dark hawk leech deck so this deck is very similar to the um good card dark hawk deck however with this uh, version, we basically have a leech in this deck to kind of zap your opponent's abilities. Especially because I've got a feeling they're running a blob deck. Uh, they're probably running a blob deck with a um, Taskmaster. That's probably why they've um, spread out their armor like that. But regardless, I am excited to try this uh, deck out. Good cards, Dark Orc always seems to do pretty well. So you can only imagine what it's gonna be like with Leech and of course Speak of the Devil. Um I I do feel pretty good. I don't know if I feel good enough to snap though. But they have a She-Hulk. Uh, and of course that goes by Leech. I don't know if they wanna retreat or something. I might as well go talk to Doom, I feel pretty good. I don't know if they're going to do much. I don't have my Dark Hawk. There's no point in going, well, I could have got Miss Marvel and then maybe someone on the left. But I still feel pretty good. Um, I mean, this dude has the full hand of, like, no ability cards, so. Okay, just go straight Red Skull. Um, I believe we end up winning based off the tiebreaker. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, I was not expecting the Red Skull, but regardless, end up coming away on the win, so GG's to my opponent. Alright, first up is the Onslaught's Citadel. That is gonna be very nice for my Dark Hawk. So, I'm definitely gonna start just by playing Quark. Um, Iron Lad's also pretty nice. If I don't get Dark Hawk, I can try a copy, but we do have Glintar, which is a little bit annoying. Uh, it's not, not the worst thing in the world, but definitely not the greatest, especially if I do get Miss Marvel. Uh, but, you know, Iceman down the middle, I'm fine with him getting turned into a symbiote. Uh, looks like they're running a discarded deck with the Swarm, and then uh, we do have Murder World, which is a little bit annoying, but I can always move my Jeff over, so that's fine. But I'm thinking, depending on who we draw next, I could either go Iron Lad down the middle or on the left. Um, probably on the left, though, because even if I have Miss Marvel, um, playing on the left is fine. But I have five in my deck. I don't know if I want to risk Iron Lad. I Actually, maybe, because I don't want my Miss Marvel to become a symbiote just yet. I could go Miss Marvel and then Doctor Doom. Um, and we got so lucky. <laughs> oh man, that's exactly what I wanted to happen, but 30 power is pretty nice. Um, I am going to snap into that. And of course they retreat, but I was thinking I could go talk to Doom afterwards anyway, but oh man, that was just beautiful. The fact that Iron Lad copied the exact card I wanted. Uh, that's exactly why I put him over there, but regardless, GG's to my opponent. Alright, pretty solid. Um, well, bar with no name sucks, but pretty solid at starting hand. Uh, Miss Marvel with Dr. Doom's kind of annoying, but looks like they're ready to destroy deck with that Nova. Uh, we do get Monster Island. That's not too bad. I don't have any way to change that location, so this might suck. Uh, looks like they're going to probably play Deadpool down the middle there. I don't believe my rogue is going to do much. Uh, probably just go Cork down the middle. Okay, but they played Deadpool over on the right. Oh, that's fine. Do I just go Miss Marvel on the right as well? Or do I go Iron Lad? It depends. I feel like Iron Lad, oh, maybe Iron Lad down the middle isn't too bad, but probably on the right just strictly for power. Of course, to that goes to that carnage. Um, I am thinking Miss Marvel on the right though. Oh, let's go. Absolutely huge pull for, for us. I'm gonna snap into that because all their destroy cards 
Okay, that's a little bit unfortunate. I don't have a Shang-Chi. Uh, the Power of No Name is pretty crummy. Uh, but I do feel pretty good. Of course, there goes my eye, lad. Um, oh, I can't go Dark Hawk and... Damn. I mean, I can't go Rogue, can I? They're not running any ongoing cards. Do I just go Dark Hawk? He has four in his deck. Not like it really means much. Uh, but he probably plays that Deadpool, right? I mean, we'll give it a shot, but I think I still lose. Oh, wow. I think they beat us, right? Yeah. Damn it. I was trying to win the tiebreaker, but... Yeah, if only we had more Dark Orc power, we probably would have won that, but regardless. GG's to my opponent. Alright, West View is not too bad. But I just hope it doesn't turn into a bad location, but Cork is fine to play there. Sanctum Sanctorum is a bit annoying now, um, but I do have Jeff, so that's fine. Um, but I'm thinking maybe Zabu into an Iron Lad. Very risky to play Zabu on the right. Because this could be something that uh, stops ongoing abilities, but it's fine. But they do have a dead devil. Um, okay, just August Forge. That is fine by me. I've got a feeling I land probably the better choice here. Because we copy, okay, well we copy Rogue, but that <laughs> doesn't do much as we get a wave. Oh, that's fine. And we get a <laughs> Okay, Bar Sinister. So what I'm thinking is probably I want to save Doctor Doom for when we play. So I probably want to go Dark Walk. And then I'm thinking Doctor Doom on the left. Wow, we got pretty lucky there. <laughs> Very lucky there, but I still feel pretty good. Um, oh no, we don't ramp out the Doctor Doom. That's fine. Um, I'm thinking I just go Jeff, because I can still move Jeff over, um, and then maybe just Sentinel just for the power. Then I can move Jeff to the Sanctorum, and then just play Doctor Doom, so I feel pretty solid about this. Um, who knows what cards that could be, but yeah, like I said, I feel pretty good. Okay, they play a Sentinel for the power, and then they have what? Okay, Lady Sif. Oh no, they discarded something, so it, they might come back as they are. That might come back as like a, a ghost rider, but... This might be a tough one. It's the most power I can generate. Um, I have to risk it. I kind of just have to go for it. Because they, they're definitely going to play like a strong card at Bar Sinister. Uh, yeah, Doctor Doom helps. But I'm not winning over at the Forge. Oh wow, okay, so we just win. Um, Very interesting choice of playing the Sentinel there. But yeah, we do end up coming away with the win. So I feel like they should have played a stronger card. And they probably, yeah, that helped hand so I don't know why they didn't play a stronger card because they definitely would have beat me that way but I mean regardless I'll take it GG's to my opponent but I mean yeah guys yeah guys yeah guys that is it for this video 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 let me know what you guys think about the deck down in the comments below and also if you guys did enjoy please make sure to give